what I love about Haula is the community spirit, sense of aloha, the connectedness of the people. Everybody knows everybody. We help each other and we have great swimming, beautiful beaches. It's a great place to live. It's one of the best kept secrets on Oahu. <laughs> I lived in Haula for 43 years. I've been in this house, in this property for 40 years. When it's beautiful, it's a beautiful place to live. And I love it here. I, I feel very emotionally attached to this house and to the land, to the beach. I'm very worried about climate change. It worries me because of where I live and the damage that has happened in the past and is also predicted to get worse. Sea level rise has impacted my life tremendously. Um, in the past 10 years, I've had a lot of damage such as sinkholes in the yard and damage to the seawall that I've had to fix and it's a big stressor. 40 years ago, um, I had, you know, a yard full of grass that grew really well. I had a beach, sandy beach in the front of the house. We didn't worry too much. In fact, we really didn't even think about problems with the ocean. In the past, I would get splashes over the wall and usually the waves came in January. Well, the past 10 years, it's been ongoing waves coming in the yard. Um, and the waves have even gone as high as hit my deck and my roof of my house. Climate change has affected not only myself, but also my neighbors. And I've seen neighbors have to sell their homes. I see other neighbors having to fix the property so that they could keep the land, keep the house. Scientists say it is going to continue and it's going to get worse. It's predicted that our uh, roads are, are going to fall into the ocean, our homes. I'm very worried. I hope in my lifetime I could live here peacefully. I don't know what the future will hold. I'm, I'm hopeful that the more scientists can come together and communicate to communities like our community, Haula community, and gather the knowledge and apply the knowledge, we will know what to do. Because this is our Hawaii, our beautiful land, and we want to keep our beaches for our families. So the more prepared we can be and the more we can share, I think the better off we'll be.